James Gunn, for anybody who's been confused about is the new DCU a reboot, not reboot, James Gunn has just kind of put the issue to bed by making the statement, nothing from the DCEU is canon in the new DCU. Uh, that was basically the straight up statement. You know, James Gunn was directly asked about the situation on social media on threads. And this comes from the folks at CBR who wrote this. Via his Threads account, Gunn responded to a fan who sought clarity about what is and isn't canon while asking if the DCEU actor, uh, asking if DCEU actors will be reprising the roles in the new look DCU. Having previously said that DC studio films and canon start with Superman Legacy, Gunn made his stance clearer, insisting that nothing is canon until Creature Commandos next year. He then explained the DCU will have a deeper dive into the universe with Superman Legacy. Additionally, Gunn said uh, that he understood fans who are confused by what's happening with the DCU to DCU transition, given that no one has seen anything yet from the new DCU. So, essentially what James Gunn has just said, are really in the most clear terms so far, this is a reboot. Nothing from the old DCU is canon. Now, we're going to talk about another story a little bit later that, yes, a couple of actors are going to continue playing their roles. And he says that, hey, there's going to be some circumstances that are similar. Like, for instance, our new Batman. Guess what? His parents were going to have been murdered in Crime Alley when he was a little boy. What? Yep. Did they go see an opera? <laughs> Probably. Damn or a movie. Or a movie this time. <laughs> oh, no. But what he's saying is, while that may be similar to the history of Ben Affleck's Batman, this isn't the same Ben Affleck Batman. This is a different thing. There's going to be some similarities in circumstances and things like that. But this is a new thing. Everything that was canon in the DCEU is gone. And this is the first time that James Gunn came out and really just definitively said that, that the canon of the new DCU doesn't start until Creature Commandos and Superman Legacy. That is the start of the new universe. And I think it was important, but I also think he said something that is really common sense because there's a lot of people doing a lot of commentary about what James Gunn should and shouldn't be doing right now and how all this kind of stuff. And James Gunn just reminded everybody, guys, nothing has come out yet. We're years away. We're a long time away from anything coming out. I, I, I shouldn't have to be painting a big, clear picture for you right now. We're years away, but it is good to hear him basically say, old stuff, not canon. Canon begins with these new things. Guys, we want to take a second to thank a sponsor of this video, Vessi. Now, like me, I'm sure a lot of you guys have heard of Vessi, the shoe that claims to be incredibly comfortable and waterproof on top of that. Well, these claims are really interesting to me because as a Canadian who walked around in a lot of snow and as somebody who likes to go camping and hiking with his wife on the weekends, there's nothing more uncomfortable and horrible than walking around in wet feet. So after receiving my first pair of Vessis and noticing how incredibly good looking the shoes are and how mind boggling, comfortable and flexible they are, the first thing I did was I took them into the backyard to put it to the supreme waterproof test and dipped my feet in my pool. Guys, my feet were bone dry and like 20 seconds after having them in the pool and I touched them, the shoes themselves were also bone dry. Guys, seriously, these shoes are stupidly comfortable. They look great and they absolutely lived up to the claim of being waterproof and keeping my feet dry. I absolutely love my Vessi shoes. So guys, if you want shoes that are good looking, are ridiculously comfortable and on on top of all that waterproof, you need to head to Vessi.com slash Campia and get yourselves a pair today. Go to Vessi.com slash Campia and get shoes for your best summer yet. Anyway, Chris, you heard James Gunn's comments here and, and read what he said. I mean, for me, he has implied before certain things. Yeah. Again, he shouldn't be just spilling everything. What's this new DCU going to be? We should just experience that as everything comes out. But to me, this is the clearest thing he said, I think. What do you think about that? Does this coincide with everything he said before? And what do you think about the comments themselves? Well, first of all, if we're going to keep three actors, I'm excited about these three. Right. Well, um, we'll talk oh, about those three yeah. later. Well, and, and, you know, I think, I think as fans, a lot of times we are very, very precious with IP and we think it belongs to us. And while we can have a very, very direct line to things and have an emotional understanding of things and how they've related to us in our own lives, 
they do not belong to us. Our own memories and our own relationship with it belongs to us, but the characters themselves, the storytelling does not belong to us unless you start working for DC and you want to help tell these <laughs> stories. So I think a lot of times we have this very big sense of entitlement and we've seen that so much with DC. We see this with tons of fandoms too though. Marvel, Star Wars, and I've been guilty of it. You know, Jonathan and I have talked about my expectation of, of Thor and how that kind of let me down because I was so married to the mm -hmm. comic. But here, I think we do need to listen to James to kind of let everything happen. I think then this also should make viewers just go, okay, I can go in and watch Aquaman and take it for what it is and watch that com uh, completion of that two-part story, right? I can have seen Blue Beetle or I can watch it again on demand. And I know this character might come back, but I'm gonna just take the story for what it is and view some of these things kind of like an Elseworlds, kind of like one-off comics. Cause we can do that with comic books. For some reason we have this disconnect with movies where we want everything to be tied together all of a sudden. Mm. And we don't need that. I do find it fascinating, just the sentence alone of nothing is canon until Creature Commandos. That, that is something I never thought I would hear in my <laughs> lifetime, but I'm thrilled about it. Look at these weirdos. I'm so hyped for it. And then obviously, yeah, Superman Legacy is where we're going to really start diving deep. I think Creature Commando sets us up for kind of some tonality things, some weird stuff, some allowances we'll have in this universe. Could be wrong. And if I am, so be it. But I really think until we see Superman, yeah, we can't know what this new universe is going to be like. And in that movie, we're promised already to see so many DC characters. So I think we all can just take a nice deep breath and let James do this. One of the few people who I think does know what's going on is Jason Momoa. Yes. Because you, you guys remember a while, it was months ago, Jason Momoa put up a video of himself on social media coming out of the Warner Brothers studios, looking like a seven-year-old kid who just got told he's been given an army of ponies. Because he was like, like not just smiling and grimming, like he was literally, Whoa! like yeah. he was pulling a Ric Flair and like, Whoa! oh, I can't wait to tell you guys about all this stuff. Clearly, because he had just met with James Gunn and Peter Safran. So... I mean, clearly he's somebody who knows what's going to be happening in the DCU, not DCEU, and uh, he seems pretty happy with it. So, I don't know. We'll see how that all goes. Yeah. Hey, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. Make sure you like the video, leave a comment, and subscribe to our channel. And don't forget, we have a daily podcast called The John Campy Show Podcast, available on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or your favorite podcasting app of choice. Go and subscribe to it today so it'll be there when you need it.